like for the Metal Cell with a few more gig announcements. We've got a couple of festivals coming up, so you may want to hear some details on them because they are not ones to be missed. The Crypt of the Rift Festival is returning the 4th and 5th of August at the Voodoo up in Belfast. Day tickets are £15 and weekend tickets are £25 with doors 7pm each day. 10 tonne slug, 7.5 tonnes of beard and Elder Druid will be playing with many more bands so you may want to check that out. Templemore Metal Festival is back the 5th of August. The Old Malt House is the venue with doors at half one and the entry is €5. Euro. Chemical Addiction, Neon Empire, The Grudge, a Tool Tribute Band, and Chop Suey, a System of Down Tribute Band, are all playing with many, many more. So you may want to head down to Tipperary for that one as well. Sligo Metal Fest is commencing the 5th of August as well. Andersons will be hosting the festival with tickets €15 Euro per night, and weekend tickets are €26.50 Euro for the weekend. Pantera, a Pantera tribute act, Tusk and Cursed Sun are playing the Saturday. With Metal Mania, Pure Sonic Outcast, and Magna Pina are playing the Sunday with more bands on the bill as well. American thrash metal band Sacred Reich are coming to Dublin the 10th of August. The band are playing the Opium in, in Dublin with special guest, animator, and hidden intent. Tickets are €26.50 Euro from Ticketmaster, and that's not including the booking fee, so you may want to get down to Dublin for that one. Sacred Reich are really good. The Nirvana Tribute Band Lounge Act are playing the 12th of August. The band will be playing Fibbers, the main room, with Snowblind, Even Angel, Shrink Like Alice, and Bar Fight. Doors are 8 p.m. and admission is free. So if you're a Nirvana fan and in Dublin that night, or in Dublin, go and check that one out because they claim to be the best Nirvana Tribute Act around. Northern Irish Doom slash stoner band Gravity Wells are playing their first headlining gig at United Tribe Studios the 18th of August. Joining the band will be Asphyxiation, as well as debut performances from Sacred News and Optic Chain. Tickets are £15 and it is a BYOB event, so if you plan on drinking, you have to bring your own booze. The Northern Irish band rock band with Groove are having a vinyl launch show at the Limelight in Belfast the 19th of August. Sky Pilots are having a launch for the band for their third album, Simple Beasts. The band will be joined by Grave Path, The Boat Sank and Red Mountain on the night. Doors at 5pm with tickets being £7 including the booking fee. Also the 19th of August, The Crawling are having their album released at Fibbers for their album All of This for Nothing. Grave Sermon will also be playing that night. Doors are 8pm and tickets are €8, Euro, but that's not included in the booking fee. UK thrash metal band Burner are coming over and going on tour with Corks Worn Out. Uh, so you may want to take a few notes if you're planning on going to the free date. So I have a lot of information. Dublin band Levain and New Mud will be joining the band for their Fred Zeppelin gig in Cork. Levain will also be with Burner and Worn Out in Wheelands up in Dublin in the upstairs. The dates for the tour are the 24th of August for Wheeland, the 25th for Fred's in Cork, and the 26th for Dolan's in Limerick. Doors are half eight for the Cork gig, with tickets being 12 and available from Eventbrite. Doors for the Dublin one are 8 p.m., with tickets being 12, not including the booking fee. And I could not find a tour, um, a door time for Dolan, so I'm sure it will be uploaded in the next coming weeks. And last but not least, a night of death metal is to be had the 25th of August in Fibbers. In Entombed cover band Damn Deal Done are playing the band's 1993 album Wolverine Blues in full. The band will be joined by Unmaker and War of Attrition. Doors are 7 p.m. and tickets are 8 euro. So that is all the gigs happening around the country for the next few weeks. So if you want to try and make it down to maybe Sligo or Temple Moor for the metal festivals even check out the lads for the burner uh tour because they'll be coming over they make some really good fresh metal music but for now that's like signing off and see you soon <laughs>